Chin with here, and I'm here with my Style Secrets with Megan video series. And today I'm at the beautiful Saks Fifth Avenue talking about sunglasses. So one of the most common questions I get from my clients is how to select the right shape sunglass for your face shape. So today I'm gonna break it down by face shape and give you all the details on how to make sure your sunglasses are right for your face. So the first face shape I want to talk about today is the heart face shape. So think of Reese Witherspoon. She has this shape. So for this face shape, doing something that's more like a classic Wayfair, think of Ray-Bans, is best for you. So these are both by Tom Ford. I love both of these. The tortoiseshell is really nice if you are maybe more fair complected and don't want something that's going to wash you out. I love this. This color, this really beautiful neutral in this plastic frame is really on trend right now and it looks beautiful on redheads and people with darker complexions because it really pops. So the next face shape is the round face. So if you have a more rounded face, it's really important to pick the opposite shape sunglass as your face. So square. So I love these by Oliver Peoples and these are Fendi. These are both fantastic because as you can see, let's look at the Oliver Peoples one. It's really nice and kind of squared off. That's going to be a nice contrast to your face shape. If you select something that's too round, it will enhance the roundness and just not be flattering. So I love these. Again, the really nice neutral is very on trend. And then this is a really nice take, fun take on tortoiseshell, having the two-tone. I love these as well. So now let's talk about the oval face shape. I love both of these for the oval shape. And to be honest, the oval shape can really wear a lot of different silhouettes. So you can really have a little bit more fun than some of the other face shapes. But let's still give you some parameters. I love both of these. They're both by Jimmy Choo. This one is really nice classic Jackie O style, that kind of oversized shape. And this one is a fun pair, especially for summer with this blue pop. And this is a nice take on um, the classic Wayfair as well. The only thing that oval face shape ladies want to stay away from is an oval shaped frame. So again, select the opposite of your face shape. So the last face shape I want to talk about today is the square shape. And so you may wonder when you see these kind of fun John Lennon type round sunglasses, who can actually wear those? Well, my square face shape ladies, you can rock these. They definitely are a trendier piece, but with the 70s in full swing, we're seeing a lot of these. These are really fun by Miu Miu. And then this is a more classic shape. If maybe, you know, trendy one like this isn't really for you. I love these, again, by Tom Ford. This color is really beautiful on almost all colorings. So make sure, if you have a square shaped face, that you select more rounded frames. It doesn't have to be this extreme, but you want it to have some really soft, nice edges to, again, soften your face shape. And finally, if you're not quite sure what your face shape is, or you think you're kind of in between, no worries. These two pairs are universally flattering. This pair of classic aviators by Tom Ford, you can't go wrong. Aviators with a medium sized frame like this, which is a really classic, no hardware metal, really, really nice, very timeless. And this pair is a little bit more funky. I love these as well. These are Jimmy Choo. Again, as I talked about earlier, the funky neutral frame, but the shape of it, as you can see, it's a slight cat eye. And so it's got some sharper edges, but it's also got some rounded edges. And the frame is a medium size too. So therefore it's really gonna work on a lot of different face shapes. So if you like this video, make sure to check out MeganLarusa.com. On there, you can sign up for my free 25 favorite style tips and get more videos like this one in your inbox. Thanks as always for watching and I'll see you in the next video.